They figured out the calendar that we all use, and it's a fucking awesome count. Sorry to drop an F-bomb. <laughs> the leap day overcorrect the calendar. Overcorrect. Yes. That one day every four years was slowly putting too many moments into the year. How long do you have to wait to remove a leap day that you would otherwise put in? That's every hundred years. So every hundred years that would be a leap day, you remove the leap day. Turns out that undercorrects it by an even <laughs> smaller amount. How long do you have to wait before you have to put a leap day back in? Every four 400 years. Oh, God. So, the year 2000 was a century year, which normally would not have a leap day, except it's a century year evenly divisible by 400, so they put the leap day back in. Everybody on February 29th in the year 2000 said it's just a leap year because it's divisible by four. No, it is a rare leap year. It is a century year divisible by 400. That corrects it back, and so now you have a stable calendar for tens of thousands of years. I gotta give props to the Jesuit priests, because